Hi everybody, welcome back to Sibelius 7 tutorial here at educator.com. Dynamic parts. In this chapter, we will talk about how the dynamic parts work in Sibelius. What is dynamic parts? Other notation programs require you to extract parts for each instrument as separate files, which means that if you need to make changes to the full score, after a first rehear rehearsal, for instance, you either have to make the changes in the parts or even extract them again and wasting a lot of time. At this point, Sibelius uses a revolutionary approach by which any change made in the score is automatically made in the part as well, or vice versa. You can edit dynamic parts in exactly the same way as you would in the score. You can move, add and delete notes, add slurs, expression markings, etc. But whenever you change something in the score, the parts are instantly updated and vice versa. You don't need to extract dynamic parts and in fact they are all kept in the same file as the full score so they are easier to organize as well. So basically any of the parts which I have a score here with the five instruments, some wood, wind and brass instruments. Over here we make like some changes on the part and uh, we will automatically see those changes in the full score or vice versa.